In this video, we're going over some breaking news updates which just happened in Prodigy. Hey, what's going on everyone? One Doctor Genius here and welcome back to another Prodigy video. So without further ado, let's hop on straight into our video. Alright guys, so as you know, it is now March 1st. Henceforth, it is a new month. Now, because it's a new month, that means the old arena season has already ended, and now a new arena season has started. So in this video, we're going to be checking out this new arena season and telling guys all of the information about it. Lamplight down, here we go, to the Colosseum. Alright guys, so this arena season will be March Contest of Champions. It ends in 27 days, 13 hours, and 33 minutes. Right, so now over here you guys can see basically this is the new championship. It's based now what we're gonna do is first before checking the seasonal leaderboard or anything, we're gonna check out what the prizes are. So now by just the looks of the first page, I think that the prizes around this place are gonna be placed around the ancient Greeks. So let's click on the prize board and see what it has to say. Season prizes! All earned prizes will appear in your mailbox on the following Monday. So we can get ourselves the Spartan's Greaves, the Spartan's Helmet, the Spartan's Plate, the Spartan's Victory, and we can get ourselves a Sparkling Hamster, right? So you guys can tell this season is based around Sparta and Spartans, right? Yeah, some of the best warriors in history. Right, so now at 1,000 trophies, aka 10 battles, you guys can get yourself the Spartan Greaves. Right, so now over here, the description of them says... The ultimate protection for a seasoned wizard. With bronze from knee to toe, you're all covered. Right? So this is a heart bonus of 6. So this is a decent item. The highest heart, bon the highest heart bonus which you guys can get is of 8. And apparently there is no heart bonus of 7 in the game unfortunately. So yeah. This is probably one of the strongest items in the game. Next up on our list we have the Spartan helmets. Right? It is a sturdy bronze helmet with a brightly colored brush on to top it all off, right? So yeah, it basically seems like this is a Spartan helmet. Seems like someone slashed a sword ac across one of its eyes, but you guys can tell it does have a brightly colored purple brush on top of its helmet, and it's also just a hard bonus of 6. Now you can get this for 3000 arena points or 30 battles. Next up, we have the Spartan plate. Alright, now over here we have the Spartan plate. So now it says layers upon layers of armor can be pretty heavy, but it serves as a great defense. So now it basically seems like they're covered in bronze. Well, they aren't covered in too much armor, it isn't historically accurate. But yeah, you guys can tell that it looks pretty cool. And you can get the Spartan plate for, by the, for 8,000 arena points or 80 victories, right? Yeah, now this does do a hard bonus of 6, so you guys can tell that all of the armor which you're going to get is going to do a hard bonus of 6, while the wand is probably going to do a damage bonus of 15. Now over here, we have the Spartan's Victory. You can see the sun's bright reflection on this spear as it's raised into the air in celebration. So now it does seem like this cat can cast a spell which is Tarclone, which isn't too strong of a spell nor is it too bad. It seems like it has a range of 3% and does a power bonus of 10. So I was wrong, it does not do a power bonus of 15, though it does do a power bonus of 10. Now this basically makes it worse than half of the wands in the game and better than half of the wands. Because it's exactly out of 10 out of 20 possible power bonus, basically on half, 50%. Right, so yeah, you guys can tell this wand isn't too good, nor is it too good, but you can get this by doing, by getting 15,000 arena points, or approximately a, by winning 150 battles. Now the grander, now the grandier prize over here is the Sparkling Hamster, which is awarded to the top 1,000 players of Prodigy. Right, so now over here, let's read the description about the Sparkling Hamster. A sparkly pocket-sized friend who loves to stuff lots of food in its cheeks, right? So over here you guys can see we have the sparkling hamster and here you guys will see its mini walking animation right over here. It's sitting animation and if you guys ask me, this is a pretty rare thing. You guys can only get this by doing either the arena season or by getting it on the twilight wheel. Now of course on the twilight wheel it does appear randomly every day and there's like a small chance of it. So yeah, you guys can get this from the twilight wheel although it may be likely or unlikely. Unlikely. So now in this season, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be trying to get into the top thousand, or not. I probably won't be able to make it into the top thousand. So as you guys know, in the last video, I said I would make it to the top thousand in the arena, and I did not. Well, I can't do that this season because I do have finals going on right now. So yeah, video publishing might be a little bit scattered like last month, but yeah, that you guys should be able to expect that. But yeah, now let's check on the seasonal leaderboard and see who has. The maximum amount of points in a day. 
Right, so right now we have done zero battles and our rank is currently unranked. Now let's check on the leaderboard, right? So it basically does seem like Woodland... Now basically it seems like Woodland Adrian is on the top of the leaderboard once again with an astounding 57,170 arena points. In other words, that's approximately... 551 battles and if you guys ask me that is actually a pretty crazy large number now on the very bottom of the list we have ourselves Jeffrey storm chaser who is at level 100 and it seems like they have themselves approximately 11,800 arena points meaning they have won 108 arena battles within a few hours so if you guys ask me these people are absolutely crazy they got so many arena points so quickly now I'll give you guys a second to like go through the entire leaderboard and see the people in it. Five years later. And yeah, there we go. We reached the bottom of the list. So yeah, that's basically all which is up in this update. So basically this video was just covering the arena season and maybe in our next video we will be covering something else which will come around. So anyways guys, that's all for this video. I hope you guys found this video informational and entertaining. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up if you guys haven't already. Don't forget to comment and I will be catching you all next time. One Doctor Genius, out the house, bye and have a good time.